Uh, morning. <clears throat> Welcome again to this wonderful show, um, a rise to greatness morning show. And this is day two. And today we'll be talking about playing big, right? Playing big. I'm just going to get into all right, just ensuring that I am live. All right, so <clears throat> and everything, the sound is out and it is all good. So, you know, <clears throat> for those of you who are just coming across um, this video on Facebook or you might have been just seen it on my YouTube channel because this will also be posted on my YouTube channel. What is a rise to greatness is it's basically what I want to do for myself and for others is it's about realizing what is your one word my one word is greatness and and so everything that i do um from this point onward you know i've been it, it's all about how can i live my greatness and in living my greatness it is inspiring others to also live their greatness and live their truth because my truth is my truth and your truth is your truth what is it that you are created to do is in you, you know, and and so there's there's a saying that said, you know, don't don't stop shining or, or believing that you refusing to shine um, by you shining, right? It unconsciously give others the opportunity to shine. So when I live my greatness, persons are out there they're going to look and say, yes, I see a young man that is living his truth, then I can also live my truth. If when you who are watching me, you start to live your truth, whatever that truth, whether it be belief, whether it be faith, whatever, you start to live your best life, others are going to see and join. So today I will be talking about playing big. What does it really mean to play big, right? What does it really mean to, to live a big life? For there are so many of us who are going through the motion that we are living small, right? Uh, for what, what persons may look at and you say, uh, yes, he's, he's doing his thing. But are you truly doing your best? Are you living your biggest life, right? Is the is 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 there are so many teachers, right? They love teaching, but is it that you are giving your one hundred percent? Are you playing big, or you are just going through the motion? That's the question that I want to ask you. I know for myself that I'm not playing big. I'm not playing big, right? I had a vision of I, I can't forget walking by, <clears throat> you know, where the bus stop is, where they have the party. They still have the party van, right? Where the taste is there. And I look on there and I could see Folly and I could see Titchfield and all the era that was a sea that was in between. I see I saw myself speaking to thousands of persons that, that that big. Right? Right. That is playing big for me. But what I have done, I have allowed situation, I have allowed things. And I've loved persons to say, you can't do it. <clears throat> and I've loved, I love, I love persons who did not give me the stage to speak to that to amount of persons to, <clears throat> to, to, to kill that. But now I'm deciding to play big. This is one of the opportunities that this gives me, that Facebook gives me, that YouTube's give me, is to play big. And playing big is becoming the best version of yourself. No one can tell you how big you are playing, but you, when you go to bed, when, you're, you're, when your head hit the pillar in the night, can you say that I've given all today that I could have given? Right? Can I say that there was nothing more in me to give? That is playing big. Because some of us are, are just going through the motion and expect that, yeah, life is going to show us. And, and, and life is supposed to, to give us. <clears throat> Someone said, said it this, your first 10,000 photographs are going to be your worst. So you know, you know why I'm doing this? 
I'm saying, guess what? I want to be big. I want good morning. <laughs> good morning. Glad to have you on. All right. I want to play so big, right? That it doesn't matter. So coming here every morning, it's me. It's, it, it is me putting out my worst 10,000 speech because I still know I'm going to revive that, that desire that to, to, to speak to that large crowd because I know that there are persons who need to hear my voice. That is me playing big, right? It's me getting out of my shell. It's me becoming better at, at reaching audience. Now I can sit behind this, um, where I'm at, and I'm wherever you are this morning. I'm saying arise to your greatness. I'm saying arise to the best version of yourself. What is that best version? What is playing big for you? What does that look like? What does playing big look like for you? Is it mean that your, 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 your talent and your skills, you're going to double them down? Is it meaning that if you're earning $10,000, you're saying, I got, uh, uh, I'm going to earn twenty, or I'm going to earn 100000 What is it? It may be different. Is it mean playing big is that you are feeding one person um, per week from your salary as, as, as contribution, and you're saying that I want to double that to ten, a hundred? What is playing big for you? That's what I want to do. Playing big for me is becoming the best version of myself. The best version of myself is living in greatness. It's becoming so good that persons cannot ignore me. It's becoming so good at my craft because I, what I love to do, I love to talk. I love to inspire. I love to motivate. But if I am not good at it, don't care how good I am, no care how I love it, I won't reach, I won't be playing as big as I can. So it's, it's a determination is that I love this. Now, how can I play big by becoming the biggest version of myself? That's a question for you. How is it that I am going to grow each day? How is it that I am going to, you know, um, evolve? So I, someone said this, and I, I also said that the person who you see is most successful, they have failed most often. The person who you see that is most successful, they have failed the most. You know why most of us who are not successful, we have not failed enough. I want, I want that to sink in. For those of us, you have not failed enough. If you are not at the, the place where you want to be, it's because you have not failed enough. How can you say that, Inzer, that I'm not feeling enough? The light bulb that we have here, the light bulb, it is said that Thomas Edison failed 10,000 times in trying to light. And what he said is the difference between successful persons and failures. He did not say that I feel 909,999. So I'm going to stop. He went on. And when he looked back at 10,001 and he got the results that he required, you know what he said? I've learned 10,000 ways how not to light it. He have learned. So many of us, we try something one time or two times and it doesn't work out and we are not learning. We are not learning from what the experience has taught us. And then we just stop and we give up. But I'm saying to you, those who are more successful, they fail the most often. And so somebody will look at me and say, you know, Bill Gates, they must fail and listen, Training is a control failure. So most persons who you see, so this is training for me. This is controlled, right? It's not me standing in front of a stage and not remembering my words. So I'm using this as a training. I'm using this as my 10,000 10, videos that I'm going to put out there, right? That I'm going to be better. 
There's no way that I'm going to come to you every day, every day and speak and not get better. There's no way that you're going to work on your craft day after day and day after day and not get better. So I'm saying to you, right? Arise to your greatness. Stop playing small. Decide what it is going to be. Decide how is that going to affect my family? How is that going to affect my life? How is that going to affect um, the way that I view myself? Morning, Raymond. Good to see you on. Right? How is that going to, to affect everything around me? And start playing big. Stop allowing the naysayers to, 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 to make you play small. Because I'm going to look bad in their eyes if I do not um, achieve my goal. Or if I quote-unquote feel from last year april the fourth i said this i will never lose again in my life i either win or i learn and so it it, it has grown to me that I'm, i have become less attached to the results i'm more attached to the work that i put in that is something that i'm saying to someone to this morning Stop being so attached to the results and be more attached to the effort that you put in. So if you know that you have done all you can do, then you rest assured that you gave and you are rest assured that you gave your best, then you are you can know that you can come again tomorrow and do even better. I said it yesterday, I'm going to still say it. I strive not to be better than anyone else, but to be better than my previous self. I strive not to be better than the, the best motivational speaker out there. I strive not, not to be that. I strive not to be those who are doing their things on Facebook that are doing... Because sometimes we, we become so distracted by who is out there that are doing great things in the area that we want to perform in. Right? And, and, and someone says it, stop, stop allowing your day one, comparing your day one to someone else, day 100. Because your day one is, is, is going to be a far different. This is my day two in A Rise to Greatness. Can I go there and I look at Eric Thomas who have been putting out videos all at this time, right? And, 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 and say, well, I am not like Eric Thomas, and so I need not to, to go out there and live my greatness and push and tell someone that you can live your greatness. No, it's my day too. So I'm going to live my day too as it's my day too. And then tomorrow is my day three. I'm going to be the best that I can be on my day three. Right? So it's going to, it's all about you playing big. Stop comparing yourself to others. Stop looking at you know, what I am today and realizing I am not what I am today. Today is not the final, but I'm going to do the best that I can do today. And then when tomorrow come, I am going to do the best that I can. Right? So the quote for today, uh, morning, Paul, good to see you on my brother. All right. The quote that I want to leave us with today uh, is... Courage does not always roar. Sometimes courage is a quiet voice at the end of the, of the day saying, I will try again tomorrow. Courage does not always roar. Sometimes courage is a quiet voice at the end of the day saying, I will try again tomorrow. There are many of us who... Um, we, you know, we are so pumped, but sometimes knowing that you have done your best, you have played big today and you're going on to tomorrow, you know, courage is not always roar. Sometimes the quiet voice said, I will try again tomorrow. Get up tomorrow, work at it. And I'm saying, I'm still encouraging persons, find your one word. It took me a while for, to find the one word that, that described my, my life. Whether it be courage, whether it be greatness like myself, whether it be belief. That one word that pushes you, that motivates you. 
And the question for today, the one action step, I want you to write this down. What? Give one reason why you are going to start playing big. One reason why you're going to start playing big. Is it that you're going to start playing big because of your family? Is it that you're going to play big because of your children? Because you want them to see you live the, your best version of yourself? Is it that you're going to do it because of a health condition, of your parents? Find one reason why you're going to determine that you're going to go big. You're going to live the best life right now. All right, so I just want to thank everyone that, that tuned in today. Um, thank you for all the likes. Please share this video. If you're watching it on the replay, just, you know, um, if, you, if you're just coming on and you didn't watch it over, share it. Right? Because a rise to greatness is just me coming on here, you know, showing persons that, guess what? You have talents, you have abilities. It's time to utilize them to help others to motivate others, to, you know, just to do big things. All right, so have a good day. Looking forward to see you tomorrow. And um, play big.